Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Lady J here, and today, as you can see, I'm going to be doing a quick video. This video is about me throwing on a no makeup makeup look. I've already done my eyebrows already, and basically now I'm just going to carve them out with this NYX uh, pencil. There's a highlighter on one end, and there's the eyebrow pencil on the other end. So, um, yeah, I'm going to be showing you how I can just do some foundation, mascara, and lipstick, basically just to get out and run some errands. This is nothing fancy, no eyeshadow or anything, just mascara, lipstick, blush, a little finishing powder, and... Throwing the look together, you guys know how it is when you just want to go out in the street, but you don't want to be looking crazy. So you just go and put on a little lipstick and some mascara and do your eyebrows. Well, that's basically what this video is all about. Me trying to just get out of here right quick and run some errands. I didn't want to be looking like plain Jane. So y'all know how it is. Y'all be looking in y'all purses, trying to find y'all lip gloss and lipstick. And it was like, oh, wait a minute. I can't be going out looking like this. At least let me put some lip lipstick on or some lip gloss. Let me do my eyebrows. So that's basically that look that I'm trying to get today. But I'm just going to uh, be applying foundation, blush, powder, and a little bit of this and that. Nothing fancy, as I said before. I'm just trying to get on my way. So uh, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I'm trying to uh, bring more content to my channel. So you guys, please help a sister out. Push that subscribe button push give me a like leave me a comment below and you know if you guys want to see me do anything or have something that you would uh, like to see you know just go ahead and put it in the comments below oh yeah my lighting guys is just terrible it did not come out right today so I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers so that I can get me um, some advancements you know like if I you know, can get to a thousand subscribers, then, you know, that would really help out a lot. That means that I'm striving, I'm thriving, you know, on my channel. So, uh, until I get me a decent camera, I'm going to be, well, look at me holding this Too Faced foundation, uh, born this way. By the way, that foundation is really, really good. It's, uh, full coverage, but you know, if you just want to just put maybe just one application on, that's fine too. If you just want uh, just, you know, a light look to go out and stuff. And that's basically what I'm doing. I'm not putting on a whole lot. Just one light little uh, application and then, you know, I'm going to be on my way. Uh, yeah, as I was saying, my camera is not the best and the lighting is definitely not the best. But as I thrive and come along on my channel, you guys will see better lighting and I'm going to be getting a new camera so if you guys have uh, know where I can get a deal on a really nice camera you guys can also leave that comment below and I'll check into it to see where I can get me a nice Canon camera because that's basically what I need um, right now I'm just starting out and I'm just doing it on my phone so yeah so my hair as you can see is um, twisted up I took the braids out that I normally wear when I wear my three ponytails and I just took everything down well I actually washed my hair yesterday and today I oiled it and put some gel argan eco style uh, gel in my hair and I just twisted it back up so the white that you see is the conditioner that was left over from yesterday and today I just put olive oil and eco style gel with argan oil and basically that is enough for my hair because actually my hair is curly I really don't need to twist it because I am a curly girl but I'm on a hair journey so I'm wearing my hair in this protective style for quite a while and uh, next year I will show you guys the result of me wearing my uh, hair in these twists So, yeah, let's just get to the end of the video so you guys can see how I did this 
uh, makeup look uh, right there. I'm just putting on my uh, contour, just kind of contouring my nose. But yeah, anyway, you guys, just check it out, okay? See you at the end. So, yeah, guys, you know when you're in a hurry and you see your makeup brush. And basically, really, you can have a nice look just using one or two tools from your makeup uh, bin. I have a lot of brushes, but basically, I saw this one brush and I kind of like used it for everything because uh, I really don't have time to be particular by using just different brushes. So... After I put that concealer up under my eyes, that Tarte concealer, I basically just wanted to just tone that down. So I used that um, foundation brush just to even everything out. And right there, I'm getting ready to use some blush um, to put on those cheeks just so that I don't have a flat face. And basically, uh, I believe those are about the only two brushes that big brushes that I use I'm going to use an angle brush to put on some eyeliner on my eyes but after that I think I use a sponge that makeup brush and that blush uh brush just to do this whole little no makeup makeup look so you don't have to have a whole lot of tools to achieve a look and here I'm going to use the air spun uh translucent powder just to set everything uh, up under my eyes so that the makeup don't move and yeah so you don't need a whole lot you can just be simple and reach for what's at hand at that particular time as you can see this brush here I that is a makeup uh, eyeshadow brush but I'm basically just using it right now to go up under my eyes to set my concealer uh, on my face and 
go head on about my day. Uh, sometimes when you're starting out, you don't have all the tools you need, but basically I do have a lot of brushes, particularly for particular things, and I just didn't have time to do all of that right now. So I just used a couple of brushes that was on my makeup desk table, and that was basically it. See, here I am again using that brush to just kind of set things. Uh, you see that I have on a little blush, and that translucent powder by Airspun, guys, is very good. I believe it's like $3.49. You can get it from Walmart. Even though I have the MAC finishing powder, mineralized finishing powder, that right there, that air spun is pretty good if you don't have a whole lot in your arsenal to use. So that was what I could reach for right quick, and that was it. And that voluminized uh, mascara is good, too. So as you can see, I don't have on any falsies or anything like that. And basically, I'm just going to put on some eyeliner and some lipstick, and hey, I'm on my way. So right now I am looking for my MAC chestnut pencil to line my lips with. That's what I'm going to use. And if I could find it, there it is, right there. I love this chestnut pencil from MAC. Um, it really does a great job in lining your lips. And as you guys know, fall is right around the corner. And this pencil, you can actually fill in your lips and have a beautiful brown color for fall. If you don't have any dark lipstick, you can put the MAC pencil on your lips. And then you can take some Vaseline. And after you fill your lips in, and just put a little bit of Vaseline and rub it in. And you'll have a beautiful brown glowy uh lip color so yeah so that lipstick that i have on is by kylie uh Ca candy k i believe it is yeah that's kind of like my favorite neutral lipstick so i usually wear that one every day just you know 
even around the house, I'll just throw that on right quick. So, yeah, there we go. Just about at the end of this video. Um, I'm so glad you guys stopped by. You guys are really showing your appreciation for me by looking at my videos and pushing that like button. And, yeah, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Here I'm just trying to... Uh, Look at these twists that I have because you can still see some of the conditioner in my hair. So, yeah, this is about the end of our video. And I will basically see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. So, here, guys, I went and looked in my purse and found out that I had this um, matte orange lipstick and I put it over that Candy K lipstick and I just wanted to see what it looked like. So you guys tell me what you think about it. Uh, should I just hit the neutral color or should I just kept this basically orange tangerine color? So guys, so. this it yeah, is my just go I'm just talking about this color that I have on my lips, look. and, and I, thought I would just come and show you. Yeah, guys. everything that I use I will be in the description box today. below. And okay. I use all right. Oil, Talk to you guys. Argan Much love. Oil, bye bye. Uh, the Eco Style Gel with Argan Oil, and this is my protective style because I am on a hair journey, and so I went ahead and redid my twist took them out and redid them with olive oil and the echo style gel with argan oil so this is pretty much uh my little routine of hair that i wear every day i don't really wear anything too fancy because i'm trying to get to my goal so uh usually when i have this type of makeup on i'm usually just going out to the street to take care of some errands it didn't take that long. It's not fancy. I don't have on any eyeshadow. I just have on mascara and eyeliner and some lipstick. So, yeah, this is me. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And this is just a little snippet of how I get ready when I'm getting ready to go out and run errands. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Much love to you guys. See you in the next one. Oh, yeah. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down there and tap the bell okay i'm looking forward to you guys doing that for me help me out i'm looking forward to it okay see you guys bye